All right, now I can finally write to Reader's Digest. All right, dear Reader's Digest, I cannot seem to digest any of your literature because most of the stuff you I write about is you. trash. So you should be, huh, you still writing those critical reviews? As you can hear, I have a gun pointed directly at your back. Kind of like what you pointed at me when you wrote that review about my empanadas. <laughs> you wrote the driest, tasteless bread wrapped around the rubberest, oh, moist meat. Oh, so you're the meat. moist meat guy. <laughs> Never thought you'd be showing your face around here. I gave you more of a chance to improve your cooking, but you didn't. I got new uh, formula for my empanadas. Hmm, I doubt it's really going to make much of a difference. How many times are you going to keep doing this? As many times as it takes. I'm going to perfect my empanadas, and I'm going to blow you away. Hmm, have you ever thought about making calzones or anything like that? It's pretty tasteless. And with those, <laughs> all you really need is a good dipping sauce to go along with those calzones, and maybe you can salvage whatever's left of your reputation. You don't mess with a man's empanadas. You don't suggest calzones. You know, you're not the first one to threaten me with a gun. There are plenty of other restaurants out there trying to prove themselves. I'm just a man trying to make a living with pastries. Well, I don't know about your food. Maybe it's the lack of love and care. I love empanadas. Don't everybody loves empanadas. My first week, I had lions going around the block. My dad said he was proud of me. Pride cometh before the fall. Uh, what does that mean? I heard far and wide that your empanadas were delicious, but what I come to realize is that you're just a hack. Watch your tail. Oh, you already said it. And everyone read it in the newspaper. The most trusted source of information. It'll never die. Well, consider this a letter to the editor. I have something to say. When you sunk so much money into an institution, only to have the people criticize that institution, it just, it just makes you go crazy. Hmm. Well, you told me yourself you were praised when you were first open. Oh yeah, and then you ruined me. Ah, uh, it's kind of funny how you can be adored by so many people, but get all hung up on one bad comment. There are a lot of bad comments in that piece. Changes your whole dynamic of everything. Hmm. Well, it won't be long now. Hey, Chuck, I'm wondering, uh, do you want some empanadas tonight? I know you really like that place. Oh, hey. Oh, run! This guy's empanadas are dry. You just couldn't resist, could you? Ow, woo, woo, woo.